Yo guys, Josh Burns, one, two, three here for another video. It's another Watford vlog, and it is Watford at home against Swansea. Wednesday night kickoff, and just rushed over from work. Now, Watford have about 10, 11 teams that are lower than them, right? But they're only six points off the relegation zone, so you have to say it's borderline a relegation battle, but I'm sure they'll be all right. I mean, they have to win today. One, you know, Swansea are 14th, Watford are 12th. So Watford needs to really win. It's getting dark. But yeah, Watford need to win. I'm going to say a scrappy 2-1 win to Watford. And yeah, see you at the stadium. Right, so I have to say something really awesome. I go to Bushy Village Hotel um, gym with my mum. There's a gym in the hotel um, very near to Bushy. And it's very near my house. And yeah, I go to the gym. I go swimming with my mum to keep healthy. And there's a conference room right by the entrance of the uh, of the gym. And what do I see in the conference room? I see the whole of the Watford squad there, the whole of the staff, the academy players, and the starting eleven as well. All of them, the whole Watford squad. I couldn't believe my luck. No one else was there. I bet lots of Watford fans that are here today would have wanted to be where I was yesterday. So I just said to my mum, "No gym today. Let's just sit and wait for all the Watford fans, to, Watford players, sorry, to come out." And um, it's crazy because I met them all, apart from Dennis and Espria, who are like the two best players. Dennis and Espria went to uh, their room much before me and mum arrived. But everyone else was eating their food. And I met every single player, literally every player. I'm going to add it in now. It might make the video longer. I'm going to add it in now. I met every single Watford player. Unbloody believable. I, can't, I know they're not that famous, but they're well known around here for sure. You know, thousands watch them all the time. So that was such a surreal moment. VIP seats today. Shoot! No, you had options there. Should have squared that. That's it. Just oh. oh god, what was that? What, I, I, did, I did not film that because that was such that was such a terrible mistake it is impossible to film that because it was just a complete mistake from the defender and the goalkeeper and they're completely it's, it's like oh, it's their own goal I think what the fuck was that oh my god Darling, 
give it a whack. Come on. Come on, Ken. Yes. Oh. Oh, god. oh my god. It's pathetic. How did they not score that? That is the second game-changing mistake we've made. How can you do a mistake like that? For God's sake. Well done, Backman. Emmanuel. Hit it. Yes, hit it. Too long. Save. Oh, so lucky it's only 1 0. That's half time. Deary me. That is shit. It was terrible. There was no urgency, nothing going on at all. Really bad football and a couple of mistakes which made us go 1 0 down. Just so, so bad. So we really have to go and score and win this game because it's a must win game, man. to win it, come on. I hope you enjoyed it. I mean, seeing the Watford players was so cool. I know they're not too famous, but, you know, 
around this area, around Watford, you know, thousands of people would want to do what I did. So I'm so lucky and humble and fortunate to have been able to, you know, do what I did and meet all the players like that. Amazing. Um, and it's played the video a bit longer than normal Watford vlogs as well. But yeah, um, I kept saying must win, must win for Watford. But, you know, I'm sure they'll still be all right for survival. But it is getting a bit close now. But look, they need to just get a win now. How, how many home games will it be till they win? It's Coventry up next. That'll be even harder than this game was. But yeah, one all. We can't moan too much, I guess. And hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a like, subscribe if you're new. And peace.